Tonight, I'm actually at the Loop Bar, right here in central Melbourne, where I get to speak to the brains behind the production of independent films. I'm Alexander O. Montgomery. Please join me. Oh, as much as I hate comparing, I think I have to say the first one, Message from God. It's my favourite as well, actually. Yes, I feel that was probably the most touching, really, thinking about that's the reason I don't. I always have to answer to a block number, because what if God's calling, as the film really reached out to? So. Oh my God, you know what, in my culture, when God calls me, it means that I'm going to die, basically. Oh, uh, well, hopefully it's on the block number then. <laughs> um, I liked the epicness of the Queen of Heaven. I thought it was fantastic. Um, it, it reminded me of the old Ben Hur movies, mm -hmm. um, and it was just something I've not seen in, in a in a film um, in this day and age. So yeah, I thought it was pretty good. I don't play favourites, mate. I'm Switzerland. I don't play favourites. I love them all. I think everyone put in a really great effort into their films. Um, you can really see the work that's gone behind each of them, you know, from the editing to the production design, you know, all of those elements have really come together to make really great independent film. So, um, for all inspiring actors out there, yeah. uh, do you have something to tell them? Um, I think it just comes back to why are you doing it? If you think you're just going to be, you know, trying to do it because you think you're going to be famous or something, maybe you're in it for the wrong reasons. So um, I can only, I guess, speak for myself and it's just about being a storyteller, being passionate about it, you know, and just really creating a world, whether as a director and a filmmaker or a nice an actor, just to step into this, my character or create a world that I can just immerse the audience in for, whether it's five minutes, whether it's 90 minutes, and just take them out of their little daily lives, you know what I mean, and just give them something different to maybe to inspire them, to scare them, to help mm. them dream and, you know, just take you out of the mundane for a little while. <laughs> I love the fire in you. Is there something that you can actually tell our viewers tonight? And, you know, what can they do if they wanted to actually, you know, get into the film industry? Oh, just start. Let's say all you've got is an iPhone. An iPhone can do HD. Um, I, I mentioned before, my first script I just wrote. It had very little in it, and it wasn't actually my first movie. I did one before that, and I actually did do it on the iPhone, and it actually did go out on a Troma anthology, and it did quite well. Um, although I did have very good makeup artists and people working with me, but we did it um, as found footage. So just get started. Um, I think what Alexander, what you said earlier is the most important thing, passion. If you want to be alive, get a passion and follow it, get right into it. Be like when we were 13 and you turned on the TV and you saw your favourite band and you had something to live for and you had something you wanted to talk to all your friends about. Have you heard this band? And if you can't do that, Watch my films and run around and tell everybody <laughs> you haven't seen nothing yet. You've got to see this guy. Absolutely.